In this video, you will learn step-by-step -step guide on downgrade macOS Big Sur to macOS Catalina on your Mac. Welcome to HowTWazolve YouTube channel, here's Kelly from HowTWazolve and I will see you how to do it in 4 simple steps. First is to download macOS Catalina setup file on your Mac. The second step is make macOS Catalina bootable drive using terminal and Third steps if the install macOS Catalina using the bootable drive. And set up your macOS Catalina. Please note that keep important backup file using Time Machine, all data will be erased. So later we can restore data from a recent backup. Here's my Mac is running on macOS Big Sure, from top left corner Apple logo to find the option for about this Mac and check your Mac is running on macOS Big Sur. I going back to macOS Catalina because some apps are not compatible with this latest version. Or some users have an issues with battery draining, Wi-Fi, or other connectivity issues. Let's fix it by downgrading, after that, you can upgrade to the latest macOS anytime. Open system preference from top left Apple logo on your Mac screen, now find and click on software update. Wait for few seconds and you will see the profile details on your software update window. Click on details option and go with the option restore default to remove developer profile and unenroll your Mac from developer account. Your Mac will ask to enter your Mac login password. Enter the password and remove the profile. Now, wait more you will see the beta profile removed from the software update window. Next is to go for download macOS Catalina software download step. After public update to macOS, you might not find an earlier version of macOS on the App Store. So find in this way, open Safari and search macOS Catalina in Google. And open App Store link. Now you will see the Mac App Store page in browser, now click on view in Mac App Store button and Safari will open App Store with macOS Catalina get option. Once you click on the get button, you will see the software update will try to find and download the macOS Catalina setup file on Mac. Your Mac will ask download macOS Catalina, click on download, and start the download process. Wait for download complete. Some users found a varied pop-up like this copy of the macOS Catalina installer application is too old to be open on this version of macOS. Quit this pop-up and check you have downloaded macOS Catalina setup file on launchpad screen. Here's my downloaded macOS Catalina setup file. Now the next step is to prepare a bootable drive on macOS Catalina on your macOS Big Sure. Also, have at least 16 gigabits USB drive or USB-C drive. Connect the USB drive to your Mac and you will see the drive in sidebar. First, you have to rename the drive with single word, here I am set drive name by right click on it and give how wasolve. That's pretty easy. Now, check out the command line for the bootable drive in video description page. Also you can copy from Apple support website. Just copy this line for the Catalina bootable drive. Now, open a terminal on your Mac using Spotlight or Launchpad, open terminal window on your Mac and then paste the command line. Remember that change the command line path and replace volumes to your drive name, see on my screen carefully. Now hit the return button to run command, you have to enter the Mac login password to run command, next again verify by typing Y from the keyboard and hit the return key to start the process of the bootable drive. Wait for 2 to 5 minutes until you see the command line like install media now available at. Now your bootable drive is ready to set up, open bootable drive from finder sidebar, and see the setup file. Don't remove drive from the computer. The next step is to install macOS Catalina on macOS Big Sur using a bootable drive. From the top Apple logo restart your Mac and on startup sound quickly press and hold option key from your keyboard, until you see the drive on your screen like this, your bootable drive will appear on the screen as well. Just click on it and you have to wait for more for the installation will start. Don't remove drive or turn off the power source. First, you have to select install macOS on the macOS utility window screen and click on the continue button to move to the next step. Now start Catalina setup, accept the terms and conditions by click on the agree button. If your Mac has multiple drive and partition then you will see the list of partitions, select the partition drive where macOS Big Sur installed. Otherwise, you can install this Catalina on other partitions as well. To downgrade the primary drive, select that drive, and start the installation of macOS Catalina. Now your bootable drive extracts the macOS Catalina file in a drive. 
Also during this process your Mac will reboot several times. So sit back and wait for you will see Mac OS Catalina welcome screen, select your country, Wi-Fi network, also enter your Apple ID to set up some settings automatically. Enter all the details, if you have any question during the setup time you can comment me. I will guide you. Now you are on Mac OS Catalina. Check version on Mac OS from the top Apple logo and about this Mac. Here's I downgraded from Mac OS Big Sur to Mac OS Catalina that's it.